things to bear in mind when you watch this video. This is a prototype, it's early in development. You will notice some glitches and typos and sound effects missing, but for the most part, it functions pretty well. Anyway, enjoy. Oh, hey, glad you can make it. Or I make it. I don't know, this is your mind after all. I'm basically imaginary you, but filled to the brim with tar and bad life choices. So pretty much exactly like you. So I, me, uh, us, we seem to have an ability to piss people off, which as you can imagine, isn't too fun. Now because I, uh, you, us, are geniuses, we've developed a kind of mental blog to deal with people yelling at us. For example, I'm going to insult you, me, us, whatever, and you need to shoot down my attack bubbles. So you have your gun, your sword, your shield, and your triggered gun. Sound complicated? Yeah, maybe it is, who knows, this isn't alpha after all. I'm testing the waters here. Have a play around and get used to it. I'm going to insult you to start an attack sequence. You smell like really bad. Nice one. You don't actually smell, by the way, just in case I hurt your feelings. In this demo, there are five types of bubbles, including the regular ones you just blasted into next Thursday. And each one is an efficient way of being taken down. Better to just show you what I mean. What kind of man wears pink? Those are fast ones. Surely we can figure out what those ones are all about. I'd say whenever you see these bad boys, prioritize them, as they can really mess your day up if you aren't paying attention. This next bubble is a spiky bubble. With these, you can only use your sword to slash them. Don't even bother trying to shoot or block it. I bet you have a chode. Look at that, ninja reflexes. Now here come the big boys, armored bubbles. These things have HP and will damage you with whatever HP they have left. You can slash these, and if you block them, it will send them back a bit to give you a chance. Smoking? What are you, 13? I'm making this look easy. Bear in mind with high HP armored bubbles, they will bounce back all the way to the end of the lane. Just something to keep in mind for when shit gets real later. This next bubble is the biggest bitch of them all. This is the Skull Bubble. And you can choose how to take this thing down. If you shoot it, the bubble will burst and that skeleton will head flying at you. Only way to stop this little bastard is to block it. Same goes for the bubble as a whole. Give it a try. Yeah, nice trench coat. Trench coat wearer, man. the bubbles out of the way. But now surely you're thinking, how do I get rid of you? This is where your triggered gun comes into play. Hold the triggered gun button down to charge this mother pooper up. Then unleash your fury on my face when the two reticles line up for maximum damage. Your head looks like a carrot. With the triggered gun, you can let go before the reticles hit, but you'll do minimum damage. Try to sneak in a few triggered shots during bubble sequences if you can, to constantly rag on your enemy's health. Alright, this tutorial is taking forever, and I'm sure I want me to shut up so I can play the actual game. Here's a final test. Use what you've taught you and make you proud. You are probably the worst character ever. That's the end of the tutorial. Now go, young soldier, and brave this world full of goons! Oh, and if you're wondering if I'll ever smoke this thing, the answer is yes, maybe, probably, not, no. Have a wonderful day. I am so gonna lose my job. Wait, why am I saying that like it's a bad thing? Jeez, and that looks like a crazy girlfriend. I'm sorry to betray you like this, Lungs. Yeah, I have conversations with my Lungs, I'm what? Voicemail notification from the call I skipped out on earlier? What? Poppy called? Ah! Stupid cigarette! Message deleted. Brilliant. Attention!
Ugh, you're disgusting! How dare you litter like that, you damn hooligan! Eh? Huh? Yes, you! The Vibrant Ruffian! Vibrant Ruffian? That's a new one. You aren't one of those protesters, are you? With the terribly doodled signs? Can't say that I am. I'm not really into signage. How about you? I am the Clinking Man! The what? The Clinking Man! Okay. I am an absolute clinker of a man! The Clinking Man! Well, Clinking Man, it's been a pleasure, but i got to get to work, so have a wonderful day. I don't think so, fiend! Have more respect for your Goonland veterans! I did not leave men to their deaths so you can litter the streets with this filth! Pick up your stick of cancer! Sorry, you're right, I didn't mean to drop it, I burnt myself. Goodness gracious me on a bicycle! You're lucky this violence ban is your shield! I tell ya, you wouldn't last two seconds under my command! The punishment for littering would be death! Well, thank God you're not king. Look, I'll pick it up now. I don't. Ow! Damn it, I did it again! Serves you right! Now hurry up and get rid of it! The smoky smell of death is upsetting Slag! Who's Slag? My pet moron! Here! She's right in front of you! You mean the brick? Oh, the brick! Oh, how funny you are! Is that any way to talk about someone's pet? Hey, I mean, I have a pet too. We could potentially just bond over that and defuse this entire situation. Never! Well, the cigarette's in the bin now anyway, uh, clanker man. The clinking man! Yeah, that one. Ignorance is bliss for you, isn't it, delinquent? Look, Clunker Man, I am sorry I offended your brick, and I apologize for Slag's inhaling of the demonic cigarette, but I just want to get to work. I'm going to be in some deep shit otherwise. I'll show you some deep shit! Can this day just end already, please? You dirty swine of a talk, I bet you don't even watch behind your ears when you show and you foul creature of the night. I tell you, I will work you into the
again! And there you have it, the demo for my upcoming game, Flappertron. I actually stream myself developing the game, so if you're interested in that, please follow my, my Twitch channel, www.twitch.tv slash DexterJManning. I will talk to you guys, answer any questions you want, etc, etc. Also, I'd love to know what you guys think of the game in general, from what you've seen so far. So if you could please leave a comment in the comment section below, that would be great on this YouTube video, that is, or Facebook, or wherever I post it. I'm not even sure at this point. But any feedback is appreciated. I want this game to be great. As for the release, I'm hoping to release it late this year. But for now, thanks for watching. And as Nathan says, have a wonderful day.